वेलकम एवरी वन टूडे विल टॉक अबाउट हाउ टू चेंज आवर ब्रेन विथ पॉजिटिव थिंकिंग एक्चुअली द ब्रेन इज सो वर्सटाइल ऑर्गेन इट कॉन्स्टेंटली चेंजिंग एडेप्टिंग एंड रीवायरिंग इट सेल्फ इन रेस्पॉन्स टू एक्सपीरियंसेज एंड थाट्स वी फील इट देर इज अ टर्म कॉल न्यूरो प्लास्टिसिटी इट बेसिकली मीन्स द ब्रेन इज फ्लेक्सीबल लाइक अ क्ले एंड कैन बी मोल्डेड ओवर टाइम बाय repeated behaviors thoughts and emotions every time you think or feel something your brain form a new connection the more you repeat thought or action the stronger that connection becomes now this can be good thing or bad thing depends on what thought you are reinforcing let's say you are constantly stressed about your job or you are always thinking that things never go your way your brain starts to rewire itself around those thoughts it's almost like creating a habit the more you dwell on negativity the more your brain gets used to thinking negatively the connection get stronger and deeper making it easier for your brain to go to those negative places even you are not actively trying to but by intentionally focusing on positive thoughts your brain can start to make new connection think of it as rerouting a gps instead of taking the same negative route you can redirect your thoughts towards more positive and empowering ones over time this rerouting can create a entirely new mental landscape and this isn't just a metaphor A study have shown that the positive thinking can literally increase the amount of gray matter in area of the brain that responsible for problem solving, emotion regulation and cognitive control. So how does one actually go about doing this? It start with awareness. Most of us have negative thought pattern that we don't even realize. We wake up in the morning maybe already dreading the day or we assume the worst about the upcoming situation catching those negative thoughts in the moment is the first step when you notice you are slipping into a negative mindset stop and ask yourself is this thought helpful is it true does it serve me just pausing and reflecting can break the automatic cycle of negativity and once you have caught the negative thought try flipping it this isn't about the ignoring reality or pretending everything is sunshine and rainbows it about reframing the situation let's say you are nervous about the a presentation instead of thinking i am going to mess up with and everyone will think i am incompetent try reframing it i have prepared for this and it's opportunity to share what i know even if i stumble it's a chance to learn and improve it is not delusional optimism it is realistic positivity but just flipping a thought once is not going to rewire your brain overnight Remember my friend the brain build connection through repetition so you need to practice positive thinking regularly to strengthen those neuronal pathway and taking a few moment each day to focus on what you are thankful for even the small stuff can start to shift your brain focus away from negativity it prime your brain to look for good in situation which help build those positive connection and positive thinking can actually change your mood and energy level you know how when you are in the bad mood everything seems to go wrong right that's partly because your brain is primed to notice negative things when you are stuck in a negative mindset even neutral or mildly positive event can seem worse than they are but when you shift towards a more positive outlook your brain start noticing the good thing more often research even suggests that the positive emotion can 
broaden your perspective making you more creative more open to new ideas and better at solving problem so by focusing on positive thoughts you are not just making yourself feel better in the moment you are actually improving how your brain function over time there is also a powerful link between positive thinking and stress management we all deal with stress it is inevitable but how we perceive and react to stress what makes the difference people who are naturally more optimistic tends to handle stress better and it's because of how their brain are wired positive thinkers are more likely to view a stressful situation as a challenge rather than threats we change the way their body reacts instead of being overwhelmed by stress they are more likely to rise to the occasion this doesn't means that positive thinkers do not feel stress or anxious everyone does at the same point but the difference lies in how they bounce back positive thinking posture resilience it help you see setback as temporary and surmountable rather than catastrophic and the permanent and guess what this too can be trained when you practice shifting your mindset you are building resilience over time rewiring your brain to handle tough situation with more ease and clarity but for some people especially those who have faced a lot of diversity or trauma this whole idea of just think positive might feel dismissive or even impossible and honestly it, it is not about the slapping a smile on everything or forcing yourself be happy it about gradually training your brain to see opportunities to find balance and to not get stuck in loop of negativity and it take time and that's why practice like mindfulness and meditation can be really helpful over time mindful can help you gain control over that inner voice that constantly criticize or doubt now i know this sounds like a lot of work and it's true changing your brain with positive thinking is not a quick fix but even a small change can make a big difference you don't have to be a ray of sunshine 24 into 7 to see the benefit it is start with little shift catching yourself in the moment of negativity and choosing a more positive route over time those little shift add up creating new healthier mental habits so next time you are interested to brush off those self help slogan about thinking positively so remember there is some serious science backing it up you have the power of change your brain to reshape your thoughts and to create a mental environment that support your growth resilience and joy but it will not always be easy but the reward are worth it so thanks for the watching and see you in the next video